Hello, today I want to talk about famous Ugandan who speak Swahili and why. You know, from people like President Museveni, opposition leader Bobby Wine and Beth J, they all speak Swahili. Uganda's military generals all speak Swahili. Top musicians in Uganda, Jose Chameleon, they speak Swahili. Have you ever asked yourself why the famous and the rich in Uganda speak Swahili? Yet the poor ones, especially in the central region, people in the central region of Uganda, don't speak too much Swahili. You know, let me tell you why. Swahili opens a lot of opportunities in East Africa. An example is me. Learning Swahili has sent me to travel to Tanzania to Kenya and also outside as a teacher and an interpreter of Swahili. You know, Swahili, if you're singing, and you think in Swahili, your music is most probably going to be heard around all of East Africa. Look at Jose Chameleon, the most popular Ugandan musician. Look at Emmanuel Okoye, the best Ugandan football player right now. They all speak Swahili. Swahili opens opportunities and new doors. But speaking these small local Ugandan languages is good. But... We need to embrace more Swahili. We need to embrace Swahili to compete with Kenya and Tanzania. If not that, Ugandan entertainment is going to lag behind. Look at BBC Swahili, DW Swahili, Voice of America Swahili. Look at the most followed channels in East Africa. They are all in Swahili. Look at Tanzania, Melada Yo. You know, they're all in Swahili. Look at Wasafi. Look at the most popular musician. Musicians from all time in East Africa. They have, they have sung in Swahili. Jose Camille. Diamond Platinum. Kidum. They all sang in Swahili. Thank you very much.